hello guys what is up welcome to my channel i'm divine Shade. if you're new so guys today i want to give you guys a deeper understanding of the black and white checkerboard also known as the mosaic um pavement which is used in the masonic temples okay so i just think it's strange that almost every single person involved celebrity rapper you big time youtubers um you know it comes a point where they're just rocking this checkerboard you know and it's you know it's very weird you know it's not just a coincidence that um yo they're just always wearing that sometimes or like they'll pop on stage with that or certain days where they all weird you know it's not a coincidence that almost every single one if not all of them whether they are latino black from spain from italy whatever every last one of them that are involved have been wearing this okay all the big names that you can name even back in the day i found pictures from like old school singers or b singers rock singers you know um that were wearing this so there is something very symbolic with this and i'm going to give my short little theory of it and then just show you guys the rest of this video the clips that i put together you guys can watch it from there so um right here it says transmasonic duality checkerboard okay and it says Baphomet Luciferian Satanic Agenda, okay? And as you see in this thing, you have like a few YouTubers in this. You have, um, I don't know if you guys know her. A lot of my watchers are guys, but that female right there on the third, the third picture, that's, her name is, um, Nikki something, and she does makeup videos. I honestly don't know what her gender is. I could never, like, distinct what her gender is. So, the black and white you guys should watch my symbolism video so we all know the yin and yang symbol okay and the yin and yang symbol means you know a lot of things good bad light dark um male female all that okay so these people deem black to be bad and white to be good okay so yang male is what they represent in this male as in good that's why they're on the light side yin as in female is why they're on the black side Put this down in my symbolism video you guys should really go check that out right here i'm going to give you guys the definition of duality okay and duality says the quality or condition of being dual okay then we have duplicity okay duplicity means um deceitfulness double dealing doubleness okay and they're also doing duality and duplicity i don't hear a lot of people talking about oh they're doing duplicity no they're doing duplicity a lot like no one really says it but they are okay so what they are all the people that you see all your little favorite celebrities that you worship they're just pawns there's someone behind the scenes running this you can call it the illuminati the cia the government whatever you want to call it but they're not you know, the little celebrities, you know, the ones that you worship, the little, um, the rappers that you worship, whether it's Dirk, Uzi, anybody, um, they're just pawns. They're just little pawns. They're literally this. That's what they are. And they move them across the board in their own way. You know, they're puppets. And I highlighted down below. Okay. So it says the definition of a pawn. So the second definition of it is a person used by others for their own purposes. So basically with this checkerboard agenda these people so whether there's jeffree star and Nicki minaj these people are used as pawns to push agendas okay they're puppets so the similar words for pawn is puppet dupe hostage tool instrument and that's what they literally are to push all these agendas they have no say so they are just out there like they probably say hey you go do this and that person said, all right. And they probably give him like a gift or something. You feel me? Now, let's play chess real quick. So we're finna play chess. So you guys can understand. So like I told you guys, black is bad, okay? And white is good, okay? So let's say, I don't know. What is the celebrity we should do? Let's say, um, uh, okay someone irrelevant i'm trying to think of a celebrity okay let's say dark okay so we're gonna use a d so dark so the white means good so dark is doing something good therefore let's say he's 
um, talking about, yo, I love everybody out here. Um, y'all do what y'all got to do. And then he tells y'all a little sad story about his life, like to get to you, to like um, make you think that he's on your side and all this other stuff. And then um, he goes and murder like five people. And now he's over here. OK, so he's on the block. So he go and murder five people and he's like making songs telling y'all like go murder five people so he makes a song say go murder five people because i did it and then he switch up and he does something that you know he does something like give back and y'all all fall in love with him and then he ends up robbing someone and then talking about and then he makes a song saying go rob a nigga take that nigga chain right and then he moves over here and then he's talking about i love god god is everything to me um just to draw y'all in to think he's like all oh, a saint and then he does something else bad what could he do i don't know something else bad make a song about it and then he moves over to the white okay and that's him again and he's like um talking about uh the struggle and all sort of stuff and that i'm a saint i just been through so many things you know and all the other stuff okay so you guys see how they use this to basically just draw us in and push their agendas and make us fall in love with them. Um, I feel like the checkerboard deals with a lot of us falling in love with them. They need that duplicity, the I'm down with y'all and the I'm superior and deceiving y'all to keep us intact with them. Okay. So moving on and on before I show you guys all the clips and everything, I do want to break down this picture. That is Tyler, the creator right there. He's wearing checkerboard shorts. Okay. And that's his little friend, Esmeralda. Esmeralda is a little girl that I don't even know where he found Esmeralda, but he's always fucking with this little girl, okay? And I don't know what's going on here, honestly, but I want you guys to look at what they have Esmeralda throwing up. She's throwing up the six, okay? That's the six, her, the circle and the three, three fingers. Yeah, they have her throwing up the six. And I just thought this picture was creepy and had to point it out to you guys. So I'm going to show you guys the montage of everything that... I, I made so you guys can see this creepy shit and why are they wearing this you know so so thank you guys so much for watching